back again on the channel with another video and today we're gonna do a comparison uh, video between oneplus Nord and 10 5g and poco x3 nfc we're gonna go through all the specifications and hopefully at the end you can make an opinion about both devices oneplus Nord and 10 was released in november so only a few weeks ago and uh, also uh, poco not long ago in september also the weight of both devices for OnePlus Nord N10 it's around 190 grams and the POCO feels a bit more heavy with 215 grams. Also the thickness, if you can see the difference between these two, for POCO we got 9.4 millimeters and for OnePlus Nord we got only 9 millimeters which is quite alright. They feel quite alright in the hand, but uh, OnePlus Nord feels more compact and more easy to hold. Also because this one is coming with a size of 6.67 inches, it feels more wide and more tall than uh, OnePlus Nord N10, which is coming with a size of 6.49 inches. And let's remain on the dimensions and the body and uh, if you can see this oneplus note it's coming on this uh, mystic ice color and poco x3 nfc on this cobalt blue color also on the back on both devices we got the setup of um, four cameras and for oneplus note uh, we got the cameras right on uh, this left corner and on poco right on the center also the fingerprint scanner on oneplus it's on the back on the rear back and on POCO it's right here on uh, the edge both are uh, quite good on um, unlocking the device also we got face ID on both devices and uh, let's do a quick test well quite fast okay both devices are quite fast yeah and it depends on which one are you pressing first but pretty much both are quite great on um, face and lock and also depends of uh, the size of the camera for this uh, selfie camera also both of them support dual sim and if you can see you can only put two sim cards on the same uh, sim tray or you can choose from a sim card plus a micro sd also poco x3 nfc support ip53 splash proof and it's coming with this rubber around this uh, sim tray which we don't have this option on um, oneplus node n10 both devices are running android 10 with oxygen os 10.5 for oneplus and the miui 12 for poco x3 nfc they are quite clean not too many apps installed except uh, the apps that installed for a speed test on both devices but they are quite clean and um, quite fresh looking also we got support for google play on uh, both devices going on the settings on uh, about the phone on both devices we can see a few specifications for both of them also for oneplus node and 10 we got a snapdragon 690 a 5g chipset with 6 gigabytes of RAM and 128 storage, quad camera and 90 Hz refresh rate. Also on POCO we got 6 gigabytes of RAM, 64 storage, Android 10 and 120 Hz refresh rate. And going back a bit on the main menu, it's quite um, the same for both devices. But going on the display right here on a refresh rate and on this one right here on the refresh rate we got two options to choose from 90 hertz or 60 on oneplus or from uh, 120 hertz or 60 on poco x3 nfc and let's make an opinion about this refresh rate and going on this uh, google news let's update it on both devices and uh, let's scroll a bit without talking and maybe I can put a bit on slow motion so you can make an opinion between 90 
and 120 hertz. And yeah, looks quite smooth on both devices, quite fluid when uh, scrolling down even on uh, 90 or 120, but um, looks more fluid on 90 Hz on this one plus. On this one looks like it stops for millisecond, but uh, maybe it's just uh, me. It's just looking like that, probably loading all the images. But this one it's quite smooth and fast and remaining on the display we got an ips lcd on both devices but with 90 hertz on oneplus and 120 on uh, poco also on poco we got hdr10 we got 6.49 inches for oneplus and 6.67 inches for poco full hd plus on both devices and OnePlus is protected with Cornilla Gorilla Glass 3 and Poco with Corning Gorilla Glass 5. And let's test out the sound now on both devices because both of them support dual stereo speakers. We're gonna try to put on um, quite medium, middle sound, not that loud. So we can make an opinion about uh, both of them. Also the brightness, maximum. Let's have a look maximum right here so you can make an opinion about uh, this display on both devices it looks quite the same quite bright on both of them and look at the colors it looks um, really really good i cannot see a much difference between uh, both of them so i cannot say yeah it's looking better on OnePlus or on Poco but uh, well you can share this opinion in the comments if you want to so the sound is pretty much on the same level and um, let's type it a bit and let's listen some music see if we got a huge difference between the quality of these dual stereo speakers from the Bow devices Okay, let's try one more time because the volume, if you can see, it's quite loud now, but on OnePlus, and let's try one more time. Seems to be a bit more loud on OnePlus on this um, volume and let's switch it up a bit more and now one plus Yeah, so definitely it's much loud on OnePlus Nord N10 than on Poco X3 NFC. And let's move a bit on the performance now on this Antutu benchmark um, app. You can find out the total score for both devices, which is pretty much the same. Only 1000 points difference between these two. And um, on gaming, which I haven't done yet, but I do have a PUBG, which we're gonna go in a second. 
and if you can see on graphics on oneplus and poco we got the same uh, settings you can put on smooth and smooth and ultra on frame rate also if you move on hd we got this option uh, to choose um, only high on frame rate and hd on graphics hdr not available on any of these um, two devices so if you want to play on ultra hd you may have to install different apps and moving on the camera it's slightly different but you're gonna find out that both of them are coming with a 64 megapixel primary camera the wide sensor also we got an 8 megapixel ultra wide camera on uh, oneplus and a 13 megapixel ultra wide camera on poco we got also a 2 megapixel deep camera on both devices and a 2 megapixel macro camera on both devices also both of them with electronic image stabilization and we can record videos on 4k 30 frames per second on both of them also on that uh, selfie camera we got a 16 megapixel camera on oneplus and a 20 megapixel camera on poco and we can record video on full hd 30 frames per second on um, poco and uh, 60 frames per second maximum on this um, oneplus going on settings on uh, settings okay right here you got different options and if you can see on video resolution on oneplus you got these options to record 4k's on uh, 30 frames per second which are hd cinema quality we don't have uh, that option right here on um, this poco but let's go also on video mode on both of them going on settings and settings okay one more time yeah we can record only on um, 4k 30 frames per second and uh, on this one on that cinema quality of uh, 30 frame per second and on the k menu we got pretty much the same uh, shortcuts like uh, wi-fi nfc and location that uh, night mode that is coming on oneplus it's quite different than uh, the dark mode that it's coming on um, poco once you touch the dark mode on poco it's gonna go totally dark but on uh, this uh, oneplus is not going totally dark it's just uh, dimming the brightness the luminosity but if you want to go on dark mode on this one you just have to tap uh, dark okay customization and you have to choose nuanced dark and on this moment the phone would go on this dark mode even on these uh, shortcuts and you can choose also for icons from square round or teardrop and so on and if you want to go back just go on this um, preset theme and it's gonna go back on uh, light on a bright uh, luminosity and going a bit on battery we got uh, 4300 milliamp battery for oneplus with 30 watts fast charging and for poco we got a 5160 milliamp battery with 33 watts fast charging and it's advertised that it's charging in uh, 30 minutes at 62 percent and in 65 minutes at 100 percent which i haven't done uh, this test yet but uh, we may do it between poco this uh, oneplus node and um, other devices so uh, pretty much that's it um, with this uh, comparison video i hope you make an opinion about uh, both of them if so uh, just uh, give it a like share support this channel and subscribe and uh, see you soon with another video